A question we get every once in a while at Genovation is how do I add a shift or toggle key uh, when using a control pad 683, uh, 682, or the uh, mini term 900 series? Uh, this is a good question. It allows you to take a keypad like the 683, which is a 24 key, a USB PS2 keypad. Um, and turn it essentially into 48 keys. So what you are going to do is assign a shift or toggle or both and that will bring in a second layer of keys. So shift and toggle work a lot like your PC keyboard. When you're on the first layer you just have lower case. When you toggle it using shifts, uh, sorry caps lock or using shift then you uh, essentially get the upper case keys so twice as much information. So what we're going to do here is click on a key we're going to right click to select what we want, shift or level. We'll set this one to shift. A little S pops up there. You can have two shift and two toggle per keypad. Uh, now I'm going to go over here and I'm going to right click again. I'm going to select toggle from the list and that's all that's to it. These keys, this will act as a momentary shift key and this will act as a toggle on, toggle off for the second layer. Okay, so now we want to add some data. Let's go to this key here and I'm just going to add some um, alphabetic data by just uh, clicking here or or typing on the keyboard. Now in order to get the second layer I go over here to these two tabs and select level 2. Now this changes to black and this tells me that I've got another layer. Now what I'm going to do is put some numbers in here. So now when you go back to level 1 you can see alphabetic. Level 2 is numeric. Uh, also you should probably set your LED to level indication so that you can tell when you've switched levels on the keypad itself and that's all there is to it. So you just save that file, download it, and test it on your control pad 683.